Hey there, Melissa here again. I'm just updating on my hair journey. So this is gonna be a video where I'm actually gonna trim my hair. So it's been, I think, six weeks. I was supposed to cut it, because I did the math, I was gonna cut it on August 23rd, but, well, by cut it, I mean trim the little ends off because they're getting a little bit of like dead end action. Uh, but I'm really excited to show, and I don't know if you can see this, but like, my hair is actually like growing so much. Look at this. This is crazy. It looks a little silly when I have my hair up. Like maybe I can show you. I have this kind of like halo of hair growing, but my hair feels like a lot thicker. Look, check this out. Look at this. Look how much it's growing. And this is because I like started doing that the hair oil routine. So today I'm actually gonna trim my hair and then I, look at that, look. It's, I was losing a lot of hair here and now it's like all growing back and like even the sides are growing back. Look at this, which is great. I don't know if you can see that. I'm trying to see here. But anyway, so um, I decided, I really don't like cutting my hair and I kind of read that it's not the best thing for you to do, but there's like mixed things. Like I, for, from a spiritual perspective, people say like not to cut your hair, that there's nerve endings and blah, 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 all this stuff. Um, so I don't really like cutting my hair, but I'm just trying to do something different because my hair hasn't been growing like I've been wanting it to. And so I'm gonna trim it just a little bit and I'll show you what I do. I have been doing like the curly girl method trimming. It's like, you just kind of trim. You see how there's like a little curl here? You see this little curl? You just kind of like trim, that's it. And you just do a little bit here and there. So I'm just gonna do that around my hair. I can see already some dead ends and everything. But anyway, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna trim my hair and then I'm gonna do the oil treatment tonight because I haven't done it in a while. Andrew and I just got back from the Woodstock Food Festival so we were gone uh, almost two weeks and I didn't take the oil with me because it was a lot to take and I just didn't really want to deal with it to be perfectly honest. So <clears throat> I haven't done it for a little while so I'm gonna do it today after I trim my hair and hopefully you find this helpful. And yeah, stay tuned since I'm, it's gonna take me a little while to trim this, all of this. Cause it's like the back of everything. So anyway, I'm just gonna start. And I have my fancy special scissors and I'm outside because it's kind of annoying to just have to clean it up inside. Oh and as you can see I'm doing this dry. I'm dry cutting my hair. My hair is not wet, it's dry. what I do I'm gonna need a mirror for the rest because it's like the sides like in the back ish you know so I'm probably gonna use a little mirror for the rest but that's what I'm gonna do for the rest of my hair and it already feels like pretty nice I might I kind of like a lot of people use a mirror to do this and I've done this kind of just following the hair and just going along to see but it feels like a lot I mean, it's been feeling a little bit more knotted at the ends it's been getting more knotty but it's like, I feel like it looks so much more full than it has in a really long time. I mean, it's a little bit big right now, but that's okay. It's a little big. But anyway, so I'm gonna finish doing that and then I'm gonna do my hair oil routine, which I can probably film for you guys that you can see that too. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you like these videos, subscribe. That way you can get notifications of when I put new videos, especially about hair up. And, or any of our other videos that we do, Andrew and I. So thanks again for watching, and I hope you have a marvelous night.